So in this session, so now we're going to talk about the RDA and, and the biochemical function and its storage. So um, after that, uh, we are going to discuss about the role in reproduction, role in growth and maintenance of epithelial tissue. And finally, uh, we are going to talk about the absorption and transport. And after absorption and transport, we are going to talk about uh, the the, uh, the its its function in the vision, or you can say uh, in in uh, in in the vision of the uh, human eye. All right, in our eye, which is also called as world's uh, visual cycle. We are going to discuss the visual cycle, but later on, now let's talk about this one RDA, which is called the uh, which is actually I'm sorry, the RDA, uh, which is actually uh, called the recommended dietary allowance. So what is an RDA? Full form, it's a recommended dietary allowance. So in adults, we required 1,000 retinol equivalent. So this is a unit for this one, which is also called RE, for the uh, vitamin A or retinol, retinol uh, Measurement so in adults it requires thousand retinol, which is actually one retinol is equal to three point uh, five uh, international unit. So that's why we can say one thousand retinol equivalent is equal to about three thousand five hundred IU uh, international unit. Again for eight eight hundred we have got two thousand five hundred, uh, which is from for women, which is required for women. I'm trying to say for women. All right, uh, for women it's required less, you know, for women requires less as compared to the male adult. And, but remember one thing that in the, uh, in the lactating mother or in the uh, pregnant mother, uh, this amount is increased because they require much more of the vitamin A in their body. So uh, vitamin A is actually stored in the liver, which we're going to discuss in detail in the, uh, in, in, just, in, just, in just a bit in another lecture. Well, in which we see the transport, mobilization, and the storage of uh, the uh, with our vitamin A. Now let's talk about <clears throat> the biochemical functions. So this is just a brief review of the biochemical functions. In the biochemical functions, we have got the it maintains of visual cycle, which is also we're going to discuss in detail about how it maintains the visual cycle. It helps in the epithelial cells reproduction main thing reproduction helps a lot in the production we're just going to discuss it about reproduction over here in the role in the production role in growth and maintenance of vital tissue in just a bit but this is just an overview regarding the biochemical functions if you're having an exam so it will help a lot and the retinol performs all functions of retinol remember this one the retinol performs all functions of retinol uh, regardless of being an aldehyde because these are both interconvertible but retinoic acid which is the oxidized form retin of retinol, actually, retinol, we have just discussed, is oxidized form of the aldehyde retinol, performs the function of the growth and maintenance of epithelial tissue. All right, 